Well, do you need a new class for Merkborg? Um, I've got one to show you. It's pay what you want on drive to RPG. It's called the Scum Pages, a source for all the scum you'll ever need. This guy is very much into his books, as you can see. Cool piece of art, but this here is the big piece. This is all it is, and it's the Soulless Bailiff. Um, so what you own is now the property of your employer. So it's definitely got the colors right, and it's got the up and down fonts and just the overall Merkborkish look to it. But what is this character class like? Well, it says, broken, trapped, and full of regret. Your purpose in life has been stripped away by debilitating debt. Lost to you is the quiet life you once had. You ask yourself, how do I stop drowning? Easy. Work for the evil that has crippled you. Better to be the whipped than the whipped. I like that sentence. When it's all said and done, at least you have job security. You get no silver. There's your toughness. You get a couple omens. And you're going to serve somebody. And they're going to expect something. And you're going to have to get so much of it. And that's what you're going to find out right here. You roll a d6. Maybe you get... Frogmaw, Croaking Coven of Lake Onda. And you follow little dots. And they want supernatural oddities. So that's how you find out what your employer wants and how much they want of it. Uh, and then you've got abilities. So they're not very good at presence, but they're good at strength. It says you may have shit luck and, and, now, and, and own nothing now. But having an employer does come with its benefits. All your gear will be provided to you. Just remember you are their errand boy. You owe them and so long as you do, you have to collect for them. Well, you're going to have your first mark. And you're going to roll 3d4. The first d4 is going to be for who it is. Let's say you roll up liver spot. And then you're going to roll up the next d4. It's going to be in grift. And then you're going to roll up the next d4. And it's going to say outside city limits. That's where the person is. Or they're in the sewers or something like that. Uh, so choice and benefits matches your employer. Or you can roll a d6. So if you look at like the benefits of a king. It says the pickling creed states. One, that all flesh presented to the family must be sliced. With your entrusted Zweihander. Tenderization is required to stop you from tainting your meat with armor. Minus D2 to damage and presence. Not bad. And then number three is magic is forbidden. It adds a weird flavor to the meat. So you can either roll on this or you can keep it in uh, the, the style of who your employer is. So it's pretty cool. It's a little bit hard to read sometimes these abilities, the uh, benefits that you get from your from your employer, uh, but it's cool. So you got benefits of a landlord, benefits of the queen, and they just go back to, uh, you know, Grandpappy Picklin or Frogmaw or Slither, the Baron of Secrets. Um, so it's pretty neat. So if you need a new class, here it is. Pay what you want, Merkborg. Thanks for watching.